Welcome back to Infigan, my dear friends. In this video, we have one very, very interesting and challenging radical equation, and we'll be solving for the real values of x. So let's get started straight away. Raise power 5 both sides. So we can cancel fifth root and power 5 from RHS. So x power 5 will be equal to x plus 1 times 19x minus 1 plus 19. Let's simplify RHS. 19x square minus x plus 19x minus 1 plus 19. So we will get 19x square plus 18x plus 18. LHS is x power 5. Now I will consider one manipulation step. Add x plus 1 to both sides. So x plus 1 and this side also x plus 1. So our equation which we can write x power 5 plus x plus 1. Right hand side this will be equal to 19x square. 18 plus 1, 19x. 18 plus 1, 19. Let's take 19 common. So x square plus x plus 1. This is equal to x power 5 plus x plus 1. Take all the terms to LHS. So I can write here x power 5 plus x plus 1 minus 19 x square plus x plus 1 equal to 0. Now I will consider our first term only from LHS. Let's simplify a bit. x power 5 minus x square plus x square. So we have added x square and subtracted x square plus x plus 1. Now from first two terms x square is looking common. So we will get x cube minus 1 in the bracket plus x square plus x plus 1. Now we can use difference of two cubes formula. So I can write x square times x minus 1 times x square plus x plus 1. Then we have plus x square plus x plus 1. Now x square plus x plus 1 is common. So in other bracket, we'll be getting x square times x minus 1 plus 1. So x square plus x plus 1 times x cube minus x square plus 1. Now I will replace this product factorization here. So let me write our equation once. So x square plus x plus 1 times x cube minus x square plus 1 minus 19 x square plus x plus 1 equal to 0. Now x square plus x plus 1 is common. Let's take common. So in curly bracket we can write x cube minus x square plus 1 minus 19 equal to 0. So x square plus x plus 1 times x cube minus x square minus 18 equal to 0. So from this equation I can say either x square plus x plus 1 will be 0 or x cube minus x square minus 18 will be equal to 0. Now we have to solve these two equations. Let us solve quadratic first. I will check only the discriminant value here. So if I will write the formula then discriminant equal to b square minus 4ac. 
where b is coefficient of x so i will write 1 a square minus 4 times a is coefficient of x square 1 c is constant 1 so this will give us 1 minus 4 discriminant is negative so i can say we will get complex solutions so this quadratic we can reject as we are looking for real solutions let's solve this cubic one x cube minus x square minus 18 equal to 0. I will use method of factorization. So, I will split minus x square. So, I can write x cube minus 3x square and then I need to write plus 2x square minus 18 equal to 0. Now, from first two terms, x square is common. So, in other bracket, we can write x minus 3. From last two terms, I can take 2 common. So, in the bracket, we'll have x square minus 9. We can write 3 square equal to 0. Now, x square times x minus 3 plus 2 times difference of 2 squares formula we can use. So, write x plus 3 times x minus 3 equal to 0. Now x minus 3 is overall common. So we can write here x square plus 2 times x plus 3 equal to 0 or x minus 3 times x square plus 2x plus 6 equal to 0. So, either x minus 3 will be equal to 0 or x square plus 2x plus 6 will be equal to 0. Let's solve these equations. So, I will consider our quadratic equation first. So, I will write x square plus 2x plus 6 equal to 0. Let's check discriminant only. So, I will write 2 square is b square minus 4 times 1 times 6. So, this will give us 4 minus 24. Discriminant is coming out minus 20. Discriminant is negative. We will get again complex solutions. So, this quadratic we can reject. Now our equation x minus 3 equal to 0. So from here we will get x equal to 3, the only real solution. Let's cross examine. I will write check x equal to 3. So RHS, we can write here fifth root of x plus 1 times 19x minus 1 plus 19. So, this will be equal to fifth root of x plus 1 will be 4. 19 times 3 is 57 minus 1 56 plus 19. So, fifth root of 4 times 56 is 224 plus 19. This will be equal to fifth root of 243. And 243 is 3 power 5. Now we can cancel fifth root with power 5. This will come out 3, which is equal to our LHS. So our final answer becomes x equal to 3. I hope, friends, you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to like, share, subscribe. Bye-bye.